There are high hopes of reducing environmental impacts through a large-scale introduction of renewable energy, such as solar power generation. This calls for technology for absorbing fluctuations in power generation caused by changes in weather. For example, on a sunny day, power generated by solar systems increases, but it is assumed that there are cases in which the power network cannot accept surplus power, that is, power that cannot be consumed. Virtual energy demand supply control technology can effectively use surplus power by adjusting the amounts of data processing performed in multiple data centers that are connected by a network. In this example, two data centers transfer their data processing load to each other via a network. Depending on the amount of power generation, virtual energy demand supply control technology decides to transfer a part of the data processing load from data center B to data center A. Data center A executes this data processing work using surplus power. Besides simply transferring data processing work, it is possible to control power consumption on a larger scale by additionally using a battery and charging or discharging the battery as appropriate. In this way, virtual energy demand supply control technology contributes to the local production of renewable energy for local consumption, while striking a balance between power, supply and demand. <laughs>